In the given problem, a uniform rod of mass and length L lies on a frictionless horizontal surface. It is pivoted at a point or distance x from its center. A spring with a spring constant k is attached at one end of the rod and perpendicular to the rod. Initially, spring is in natural length. A rod is slightly rotated and released. Find the value of x for which frequency of oscillation is maximum. So we have to find the maximum possible frequency for this system. Let us uh, rotate this rod slightly. Slightly that is a very very small angle. So I am rotating this rod slightly by a very small angle. Uh, this is the center of mass and from center of mass the hinge is at a distance x. So let us rotate this rod by a very small angle theta. Theta is a very small angle and this end will almost move in the horizontal direction on a circular arc. So this will almost move on in the horizontal in this direction perpendicular to the rod. So this line or displacement or extension of the spring is almost perpendicular to the rod. This length uh, this is uh, x and this length is l by 2. So total length from here is l by 2 plus x. This is like radius and this distance will be radius multiplied by theta. Theta is very small. So extension produced will be l by 2 plus x multiplied by theta. So force due to a spring will be like this. The spring will apply a force like this and this force will provide a torque which will bring it back to its uh, equilibrium position. That will be a restoring torque. That restoring torque we can write torque will be equal to this force. Force is k and this extension produced is L by 2 plus x into theta. And for calculating torque the lever arm this perpendicular distance will be L by 2 plus x. And this torque can be written as k l by 2 plus x square into theta. This torque we can write as equal to I alpha and moment of inertia for this rod will be. So moment of inertia about center of mass is ml square by 12 and this is the axis which is at a distance x from parallel axis theorem we can write ICM plus mx square and ICM is ml square by 12 plus mx square. So putting this value of i in this equation and we can find alpha is equal to k times l by 2 plus x square divided by the value of moment of inertia which is ml square by 12 plus mx square. Comparing this result with omega square into theta. Since alpha is directly proportional to theta and alpha is in this direction it, which brings it back to its uh, equilibrium situation position. So this type of motion we can say this is angular SGM where omega is the angular frequency and this angular frequency square omega square can be written as k l by 2x square divided by ml square by 12 plus mx square. We have to maximize this omega and if omega is maximum then omega square is also maximum. I am taking this function as some y and we have to calculate x such that this y or omega square is maximum. So differentiate this expression and put it equal to 0. I am differentiating it is dy by dx. The denominator will be ml square by 12 plus mx square whole square. This k will remain as a constant and this will be as it is ml square by 12 plus mx square. Differentiation of this term is l by 2 plus x minus. Now l by 2 plus x square and differentiation of this term is 2mx. Put this equal to 0 and it will be a simple equation and after solving this equation x will come out as l by 6. 
so from center of mass the hinge should be at a distance l by 6 for maximum angular frequency if in this expression we put x as 0 sorry if we put x in this expression as minus l by 2 I am finding the minimum frequency if this is maximum frequency then we should also think about what is the minimum frequency which is possible if I put x is equal to minus l by 2 then this is 0 and x is equal to minus l by 2 will be location at this point if we apply if x is here pivot is here so there will be no restoring torque due to this spring so there will be no oscillation and omega will be 0 for x is equal to l by 6 omega is maximum if we put this value then omega maximum will come out as under root 4k by m so this is the maximum omega for this situation